Hello everybody. So I'm in this video, I'm going to describe how to use DaVinci Resolve 12.5, as you can see right here. It's a um, software I use to create videos, uh, and I'm going to create one. I'm going to show sort of a walkthrough of how I use this uh, software to create videos on YouTube. So I begin by clicking uh, on New Project and I'm going to put in this project's name clearing BMW check engine light there we go create and then I'm just going to open now this is what comes up so the first thing is you got three um, uh, uh, icons here media uh, edit color and deliver and each one you use to um, manipulate and create the video clips so let's say I want to okay so I want to create so I go here to the users wait for it to load and uh, we'll put in two videos so I'll get this one and I'll bring in this one and I'm just gonna also bring in it's not related but I'm gonna bring in this one that is upside down right here so that's upside down and that, I'm not gonna put this in the video but I'm just reason there's a reason I'll show you why so now I've plugged in the three videos into this uh, center area to play with I'm gonna go to edit now and then I'm going to take my first video and I'm going to, you see these blocks? I stick it right here and it starts off here. I don't know why it says 1000, but anyway, just I started at the very beginning. Then I take in the second one right here and I stick that here. And even though this is not going to the video, there's a reason I'm going to bring this one in. Okay. If you notice, it's upside down. So my recording device uh, filled it upside down. And if you have something upside down and you want to like flip it, because watch, let's see. So this video, you go backwards, and then go again backwards. You see that's now right side up, right side up. Well, no, but this is upside down. And I want just say I want to add this one, and I want to flip this. So I go to color. I know this is a little bit odd, but why you go to color? But anyway. You would click that, see, this one's right side up, right side up, but this one's upside down, and I want to flip it, so I go to rotate, and I put 180 degrees, enter, and you'll notice it goes right here normal, and now it's right side up. Now watch, let's go back to edit, see, right side up, and if I move this here, there's, there's me playing with this whatever, right side up, but I don't want this video, so I'll click this now, and I will hit delete on my keyboard, and it's gone. So we go backwards, 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 and now I'm going to begin editing the video. So you're going to see somewhat, okay. So right there, I didn't like that, and I'm about to speak, so I'm going to rewind just a little bit, stop, and now I'm going to cut the film. So I click that little razor blade. I close right there. So like, you see that? You see that red line? Go all the way. I will go right there. Click it there at the edge. Then I will go here. That little arrow. Then I'll select this. And I will hit delete on my keyboard. And it's gone. And then I'll play back. Oh, and I will also, yeah. play back. So this car, the problem is I'm getting a check engine light. There is... Let's yep. show you. So I'm describing so my car. Put the brake on and then watch. So, handbrake is on, taking the handbrake off. And you can see there's a check engine light. So, how do we turn that off? And I'll show you. The check engine light is that little yellow thing right there. I'll show you in this video. Okay, then see there's dead space. I don't want to. I don't want that dead space. I want to delete that. So I, I rewind. 
Hey, listen. Wait, if this is another Yoshi. I know I'm, I'm yammering. Another Yoshi on. Okay. And I'll show you on this video. Oh, I'm not sure. Let's let's Wait, listen. Wait, if this is another Yoshi on. More me yammering. Okay, I've yammered enough. How do we turn that off? And I'll show you on this video. And I think that's a good enough spot to stop. I will then use the razor blade. Click. Hit the edge. Click. Go back here so I can manipulate things. And I'm gonna hit playback. And just listen. Listen to the video now. Okay, that beep, not all, so far I don't like any of this. So that part of the video from here to here, I hate. And it won't beep and I hate that sound. So I'm just gonna keep on listening and wait for it. So let's say I sit there, don't like it. Eh. It's all dead space. Put in the... All right, so I'm gonna now start the car. Should be able to see a service engine soon light or check okay. engine light. Okay, okay, we're right there. So, this is not the good stuff. I'm gonna rewind a little bit. And I'm gonna listen. And I'm gonna listen. Listen. Let's see. Let me listen. Start the car. Okay, it's still good stuff. Rewind. Stop. Hit the playback. All right. Okay, right there. When I say alright, I'm gonna rewind a little bit. Stop, play, and right. stop. Oh, I said alright. Okay, right there. Now I'm gonna stop, hit the little razor blade, and then I'm gonna click right there. Then I'm gonna flick this the little arrow, and I'm gonna select this. I don't like this. So I'm gonna hit delete on my keyboard, and this little bit I don't like. I'm gonna hit delete on the keyboard, and then I'm gonna use this to jump all the way to the beginning of my first video. And I'm gonna listen. So I'm gonna now say I didn't like that. No, no, no. I needed that stuff. You go to edit, and you can undo, and it's back. But I, I, I think it's garbage. So I'm going to redo it. So there we go. Um, now, let's jump back to the beginning of the video again. Beginning of that bit where I cut. Turn off. Stop yeah. the car. Turn off the engine completely. Front brake. And you'll notice there is no check engine light. Well, there and shouldn't be very soon. Everything is off. Check engine light has been cleared. Right there. There's no check engine light right there. I know it's a little bit difficult to see. Now I'm being exuberant here. That's it. That's it. So, let's see. Let's keep listening. Okay, when I said that's it, that's good enough. No, no. No, no. Let's rewind. Let's rewind again. So that's me going cuckoo. That's it. Okay, right there, that's it. So I hit the razor blade again. And I click right there. And I'll keep on listening to make sure there's nothing valuable. That's just all junk. So, I will select this. I will hit delete. And it's gone. And there, now the whole video Previously, it was like, I don't know, it was like pretty long video. Because um, this is like, it's a, quite a, it's like at least, I don't know, 15 minutes. I, I, I jumped 15 minutes down to 3 minutes and 31 seconds. So, that's all these various cuts. Now, um, what we're going to do is I'm just going to, uh, we're going to go to colors fine. I don't, I'm still new to this so I don't play with it I go to deliver and then when I go to deliver I'll like uh, put it YouTube 720 I'm gonna make it a video I'm gonna play with I'm gonna change the file I'm gonna change the name of the file so we're gonna call it check uh, clearing check engine light All right and then we're gonna add to the query and just say whatever usage blah blah now it's right here and then we hit the start render and now what happens is it basically records the whole video and it's rendering so it's gonna take you know seven minutes so the whole video is three minutes it's gonna take some odd seven minutes and then this is gonna take a long time anyway that's basically how we do um, uh, how, how we use uh, for how I use DaVinci Resolve 12.2 
five. There's a whole bunch of other things, but this is just a quick, dirty uh, video. Uh, again, thank you very much. Bye-bye.